Daniela Pritchard up for re-election. How's, how's campaigning been going? Well, bank, bank campaigning has been quite good. Um, I think in Bush Fair, because I've got a lot of people that I'm engaged in, and I've got a resident association that I tend to attend, attend their monthly meeting, it's been quite good. And I think this time with my campaign, what I'm doing is I've got more of Unison supporting me. So they're doing my leafletting for me, distributing them for me, as well as the Labour Party as well. I've got a lot of support also from the residents also that distributes some leaflets so I think this time because I've planned it properly from my past experience I think things are getting a bit more better than the way it was 2010. Sure enough um, Waida uh, Foreman dropped yes. in a leaflet to one house in your ward which remained nameless uh, but uh, you're really concerned about the NHS aren't you because it yes, does I impact am. Yes. But surgeries and the hospital really impact upon your residents, don't they? Yeah, and because I work in Princess Alexandra Hospital, I've been there for 13 years, so most people that live in Bushville obviously will use the NHS, and Princess Alexandra is the only hospital that is closer that anyone will get access to, and it's a place that we don't really want to lose it. So as I said, myself and my other colleague in the union, we always like to campaign. We will fight for the NHS, and we will not allow the NHS to be sold, you know, to be private, privatised to another the company which just walked in we would like the NHS to be used so then everyone will value uh, you know and use the NHS the other thing that I always say to people when I stop people and I said how do you feel and what do you think about the NHS people don't want to comment about it and I said well we all use it none of us can afford to have private care none of them will be able to even afford to pay for a hip replacement so if we don't look after the NHS and fight for our NHS we will lose it and then we'll have to pay for it which will be a shame I do hope you drive around your ward because the potholes are not great, are they? They're not at all. I'm very, very disappointed because in Great Brace, as I said to you, few of them have made a big complaint about it. They've spoken to the other councillor, Manny. We've reported it. They came, they fill it up within oh, more than less than a year. The hole has appeared again. So I think this time we've got to look into and see which builders they're using and we have to make sure that this is done properly and the shortcut is not going to be used. Do you find it frustrating? A lot of the things we're going to talk about, and I'm going to talk about street lights in a minute, is all about what Essex are or are not doing. Do you find that? as a councillor quite frustrating. The, the thing is very, very difficult as a councillor to talk about when they come and they say it's to do with bigger picture like Essex is doing that, so we have to do that. We've got to think of ourselves and our residents. We don't have to do it because Chelmsford is doing it. We've got to think of the residents of Harlow. If they're not interested in that, it's something that is their right. We can't say because Colchester is doing it, Harlow have to do that. And that's the bit I get very, very frustrated about with the street lights. You're the second candidate I've interviewed today because I interviewed the UKIP candidate who was walking about Nicholasville today. How do you feel, both as a as a as a person and as a councillor, do you feel uncomfortable at all about UKIP? No, I don't feel uncomfortable about him at all, to be honest, because he used to be a, a Labour. Um, <laughs> you know, he was one of our strong Labour supporter. I campaigned with him when he was standing on one of his wards, which was Kingsmore and Sumness, you know, 2010. And to be honest with you, Bush Fair, most of the people that live in Bush Fair, some of them work in Princess Alexandra Hospital. So I get a lot of feedback from that. And I think because I've built a lot of relationship with most of the residents in Bush Fair, I'm not too concerned. He can do his bit, but no problem at all. He could bring the game on. No you are problem. As, you are as you just. <laughs>